the tomato chips simply slapped. Look at me using millennial buzzwords. Hi again, and welcome back to my channel. My name's Chris, and I'm here today with another snack review, and it's a doozy, ladies and gentlemen. Mrs. Vicky's, which is Canada's favorite kettle chip, has dropped a bomb of a new flavor with their sweet and spicy ketchup. But before I go getting elbow deep in these chips, if you haven't subscribed to this channel yet, what the heck is stopping you? It's private, confidential, one-on-one, -on -one, and discreet. Wait, sorry, that's dial-a-date. That's great. However, this channel does come to you at no cost, and you'll be the first to find out whenever new content arrives, and most importantly, it gets me closer to my goal of 300 subscribers by Christmas morning. So go ahead, make this a holly jolly Christmas for me, for you, and for dial-a-date. That's great. Now let's get back to the program. These chips are Miss Vicky's second new potato chip of 2021, having previously hit a monster of a home run in the spring with their spicy dill pickle chips. Now, both of these are Costco exclusive, which is an interesting decision by the company, basically limiting their market to club members. Given that I've got my hands on a bag of these, I kind of feel like I've got a Stonecutters membership. It's a secret. Ketchup chips have been part of being Canadian since the 1970s, when Hostess tried to release a series of fruit flavored chips. Shock of all shocks, they flopped harder than William Hung's Christmas album, Hung for the Holidays. Because much like that album, nobody wanted cherry, orange, or grape flavored chips. Their fourth attempt, however, the tomato chips simply slapped. Look at me using millennial buzzwords. And then they were later rebranded to ketchup. Ketchup chips, as we know them, don't actually taste like ketchup. They're more like a super vinegary, tangy barbecue sauce, like what you'd expect your chopped barbecue to be drowning in if you were taking a trip through Memphis, Tennessee. So the question we have now is whether Mrs. Vicky's followed in the long tradition of that widely accepted ketchup flavor in chips, or if they kind of veer off in their own direction to make it taste more like actual ketchup. And you know what? I think there's only one way to find out. Based on scent and look alone, they certainly appear to be more like that classic ketchup chip that we're used to from Hostess and Lay's. It's got that burgundy color, less associated with ketchup and more like a barbecue sauce. Mm. So super interesting flavor decision by Miss Vicky's. They didn't actually stay with the usual ketchup flavor that we're used to in Canada they went with ketchup. And what it tastes like is actually ketchup on french fries. Ketchup and potatoes, we know they go together. One thing I'm noticing, however, is I'm not feeling much in the way of spice. People with severe spice sensitivity might feel it, and maybe it's something that builds after 20 to 25 chips. But in the early going, all I'm really tasting is ketchup, and you know what, that's not necessarily a bad thing. Okay, that last chip had a fair bit more seasoning on it, and now I'm starting to feel it. Not in a bad way by any stretch of the imagination. Like, we're still on the very low end for heat. It's like a really good black pepper that's just gonna linger a little bit in the back of your throat. And they taste partially like ketchup, partially like a tomato sauce. Can I see this replacing normal ketchup chips? I don't think so. What we know as ketchup chips in Canada are, you know, totally ingrained within our culture. They're not going anywhere. But if you're looking for a cool alternative, these are not a bad way to go at all. These are getting a strong endorsement from me. I like these a fair bit. It's a great cheat day food. I'm not complaining with this purchase and we are definitely gonna be able to go through the whole bag of these. Not in one sitting. I'm far too close to 40 to be doing anything like that anymore. But if you're in college, I'm sure that you can take this whole thing down and good for you. Enjoy it while you're young. Of course, you're in college, you don't have a Costco membership, so I guess you're SOL. In the meantime, us old people who've got Costco memberships will enjoy these sweet and spicy chips from Miss Vicky's. And as always, thank you for liking, commenting, and subscribing. I'll see you on the next one. Ciao for now.